Hey, 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 everyone. Welcome and welcome back to the channel. As you can hear, <clears throat> as you can hear, I am still sick. So I am going to kick the series off, our Let's Complete series, with a Let's Complete Easy. We're on level easy today. Um, so I chose Matchstick Mouse, the summer coloring book. This one is in the easy category. So <clears throat> it should be quick. It should be a quick coloring. We're going to use alcohol markers and Prismacolor pencils. So grab your Matchstick Mouse book. We're doing the summer coloring book. Grab your alcohol markers. If you don't have alcohol markers, that's okay. Grab any markers. Water base is fine. Grab your Prisma colors and let's kick this series off. Um, and at the end, in the comments, when we're all done coloring, let me know how you guys um, enjoyed the series. So this is episode one. And I'm going to move this light a little bit because I am using an older light. And um, I don't quite know how it's going to behave. Um, and I don't want to accidentally turn it off. So, hopefully this this goes without issues. Because um, my light decided to go out on me. And that is one of the reasons why I didn't stream. Aside from being sick. Because I'm on this kind of shoddy light and it is shoddy at best. Okay, so I picked a nice easy page. I mean, all the pages in here are pretty easy. So we're just going to start off. I'm trying to get the book to lay a little better than what it's laying. Um, I guess that's fine. So I did also pick out a color palette, but I'm not going to 100% follow this. Um... But here are some colors. Sorry about the glare. But we're just going to basically just pick some nice, easy summer colors. And we're not going to worry too much about following, um, you know, following, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, following the color palette. All right, so I'm just going to grab a yellow and my Copics. I think this is yellow. This is acid yellow. I need yellow, yellow. Off to a great start. Okay, yellow. And I'm just going to make sure that I am not have another page accidentally selected back here. Okay, so I'm going to actually do the sky yellow. I want it to be kind of like the day is almost ending and he's doing like a final day dip in the pool or the lake pond something I'm not sure what he's jumping in so also I'm not sure if the matchstick mouse is a boy or a girl um I've been making him a boy so that's kind of what I'm sticking with I guess it could very well be a girl but I'm not sure honestly I'm really not uh, hopefully this marker does not dry out on me part way through this but I'm just putting a base down because I'm going to go over most of this with my Prismacolor anyway. So, um, just get it, you know, get the base down. Again, this is level easy, so it's really no stress. Uh, we're just getting some color on the page, unwinding for the day, and just doing some quick coloring just to satisfy our coloring itch. Where it's kind of like you want to color. Like I want to color. But I'm not really. You know. I don't feel very well. So. I say okay. You know. Normal me would have jumped right in. With like one of the advanced <laughs> books already. Like alright. We're diving in with the advanced guys. But I, I still don't feel very well. I'm not really sure even what it is I came down with. I don't know if it's a cold. Or if it's you know, the flu or what I have to, I was a wreck at work and I just want to kind of relax and I do have to work tomorrow. So I just kind of want to do something simple. So I figure, well, I might as well kick off 
the Let's Complete series with Easy. I, I almost started it off with one of the pattern pages, one of the mandalas, but I changed my mind last second. Okay. Now for um, the actual mouse, I think I do still want to keep him brown. That's the color I've been coloring him in all of the other books, but... I think for the summer one, I kind of want to give him this reddish yellow color. So that's going to be YR107. And that's reddish yellow. And this is in the Ohuhu's uh, skin tone set that I was ever so kindly gifted. I cannot wait. I'm saving up for the full Ohuhu set um, from in the brush tip and the brush and chisel I think I want I said I want it I don't know brush and something brush and anything uh really I'm okay with either but I am saving up because I have been eyeing that set and I want to kind of practice with oh I mean with alcohol markers in general I want to get more practice in so um I do. I am saving up for that full set. And I have full set syndrome. I probably don't even need the full set. But um, because that is a lot of colors. I think it's, how many colors is it? 320? Something like that. Um, but yes, I, I need it. <laughs> so I have that going on. Now I'm going to grab like a pinky, peachy color for the rest of him. And I'm looking at this warm gray zero, but I use that color a lot. So I'm actually going to use something else. I'm thinking R19, which is barley beige, if I can find that. Here it is. Um, and that's actually going to be for this here part of him. I actually forgot to color the other part of his ear, so... Again, we're just, I'm just slapping color down. I'm actually not thinking too hard about anything. Just slapping it down. I w I'm testing actually also to see if I can complete this picture in one video. And if I can complete this in one video, then um, most of, most of the, uh, easy series can probably be completed in one video but we'll see all right moving on so i have we got some trees in the background and i actually just want like a nice like summer green i don't want anything olivey or anything i want like an actual green so i do have this emerald green here and I think I'm going to start with that. So that's G05 in the Copet. And I'm just going to put that on the trees. Just a nice green. I might do it in two parts. I might do the alcohol marker in one part. And then the Prismacolor in the other. Just in case some people might just want to do it in alcohol marker and leave it be. So uh, they might not want to shade it in, which is understandable too, especially if you just want to get some color down, but you're not really in the mood to do a whole full page. So you can do it like that as well. I think this is like a tree back here. And I think that's a good way to do it too. So like for the pages where I'm doing alcohol marker and color pencil, I think I'm just going to do kind of like both where one video will be the alcohol marker and the other video will be the shading part. So I'm just going to create those little noises that you hear in the back. That's just my phone. I am getting text messages. Uh, so excuse the little banging noise that you hear uh 
do apologize for that. I I thought it's actually my tablet you hear because my phone is actually um, what I'm recording from, and that's actually on a uh, silent. But I did not silence my tablet, which is actually what you're hearing, not my phone. But anyway, so most of this is just going to be this color green. And then I am going to bring in a darker green for the other parts. And that's going to be this, uh, I could do this forest green. Which, let's see, I think it's this one. Nope, that's something else. Might be this one. Yep. And that's what I'm going to use for these spiky trees. It's just slightly darker. It's not much, that much darker, actually, than the rest of it. And I just wanted to stand out a little bit from the rest of what's going on. And I am actually thinking I am going to add a little bit of that lighter green to the parts that are right here. Um, or I might go even darker. I think I'll save the lighter part for the lily pads and then put the darker one on the thing here. But this is just, this is level easy. So we don't think too hard about here. We just... Pick color and so on and so forth. And we don't think. We just do. Because this is easy level. Now when we start getting into the other levels. Then that's when we start stressing ourselves out. <laughs> uh, hopefully not. Hopefully not. I'm, I'm going to try to plan those a little bit. So, you know. If I seem a little less chaotic. Then maybe... I'm hoping that I don't stress you guys out trying to do this. But I do just want to keep the easy level and the the harder levels. I mean, yeah, the easy levels and the harder levels a little separate from each other. All right, so I'm going to bring in this olive just for this part here. I know I said I didn't want to use olive, but I changed my mind. I'm going to use it for this part. Because I want this a little dark. Because it, it, the day is getting a little later. Because I did make the sky yellow. So it's not going to be very bright. And even though this is easy level. I do want it to make some sense. Okay. Contradicting myself a little bit. But there we go. And then for the, the lily pads though. I'm bringing in a lighter green. Because I'm. I do want to shade those. So these are going to be normal lily pad colors. As for the water, I'm not sure. I think I want it to be kind of like a really rich blue. So we're, we're going to see what kind of blues I have here. Okay. So in blues, this would be a nice one. This process blue would be nice. Actually, this aqua would be nice. If we chose like an aqua green, that would be really nice. I might go with that. The process blue would stand out more though. So let's just go with that. BO5. Um, you can choose either one though. But this one looks like it's gonna... Yeah, this stands out beautifully. I'm glad I went with this one. So... Again, I'm really hoping that most of these pages can be completed in one video or two if I'm doing shading because it's supposed to be really easy and really just carefree for the basic and the easy. And even maybe the patterns. I think that if I choose my colors and everything prior and I plan it out I think I can probably get the patterns to be one video too so we will see how that works because if I can get them to be one video that would be great 
because I know you guys, some of you like the longer videos, but I know some of you also like the shorter videos. So I try to have a little bit of something for everybody and not just appease to one particular crowd of people. So there's the nice water. Now I'm gonna add a brown for these things here. And I think, let's see, what do I have? I can go with sand because that's like a perfect lightness where I can add shadows and everything. So I'm just gonna grab that. And I think it's also good that I don't do the pencil in the same video as the marker because I do like to wait until my marker uh, dries completely before I try to put pencil on top because if I, oh, this one's drying out. If I uh, try to do it while the pencil, the marker is still wet, it will kind of peel the paper up. So I do like to wait a little bit. There we go. Still, this one is drying out. I need to make a trip to Blick because I am having a little bit of some of my Copics are drying out and I need to see what kind of refills they have. Okay, now this tree branch, I want a darker brown. So I'm going to choose sepia actually. <laughs> or sepia, as some people call it. Let me try to find it. Here. Yep. And so I'm going to just do this here. It's just slightly darker. It's not too much dark. I see a spot where I missed some yellow too, so I'll come back in for that. Um, I'm going to make his little nose brown. All right. So let me come back in with that yellow that I missed. Let's see, where is it? So I missed a little spot here. And here. Okay, so our little worm guy, um, I think I want him to be a nice pink. So he'll probably be this uh, peach maybe? No, I want a pink pink. We'll do RV23, which is rose pink. So let's see. If I can find it relatively quick. Because I have a lot of pinks and Copics for some reason. Here it is. Okay. He's cute. I don't know why I wanted him to be so pink. But there we go. Oh. And then... Okay. So. And our little bug friend. I usually keep him black and white. So boom. Look. That is an 18 minute video of easy coloring and here's what we have and this is before the prisma colors hopefully you guys can see it all right hopefully it wasn't too fast and once it dries i'll be coming in with the next part and filling it in with some prisma colors all right guys let me know what you think in the comments if this is something that you want to continue to see um if you have category suggestions or anything like that Put that in the comments as well, and I'll see you next video. Bye.